hello guys today in this live stream i will be telling you that how to deploy c sharp .net windows form or console application into a exe file so that you can use that file and send that file to any of your friends so that they can also use this application let me just show you which let me show you the setup file you can see this is our project here and if i need to publish this project i need to create a exe file so this is a exe file that is this application file so basically if you launch this application this file will be there this is a c sharp windows form application and you can see it is opening here if i just show you this is the application so two people are watching the stream so in this tutorial i will be telling you how to deploy windows c sharp windows form application into a setup file exe file so that you can deploy this application or send this to your friends so that they can also use this application so you can see this is a window here simple window in which we are deploying this application so if i just show you so in this tutorial i will be showing you how to deploy this into a exe file so let's get started so inside my visual studio i will close the visual studio and create a new project so i will be taking both the examples in both the situation let's suppose you have a console application or a windows form kind of application so now let me launch the windows visual studio visual studio 2022 so you can see we have launched this so here we will create a new project so first i will take the example of a console app so i will simply click console app so this will be i will name it as test console app and then we will click next and you can select the framework which is dot next framework which is six click create so now this will create this application you will see this is a console application so inside this we are right ri just writing a console message which is console write line so let me write a, another console message on the screen that is right line and this is another hello world so guys if you want the full screenshot instruction how to do this process in a blog post i have written a complete blog post on my website and i have given the link in the video description this is a blog post that i have written step by step instruction is given to you with all the images and all the commands which are required so just go to the video description link if you follow the step by step instruction in order to convert this to a exe file the setup file so now what we need to do is that as we have written this line also we can use a function which will read line just call this function so that it will pause the application that's it so when people are watching the stream so in this application i will be just deploying this c sharp console or windows form application to a exe file something like this you can see this is a exe file here let me show you this is the exe file if you click this you will able to send this file to your friends so that they can also use this application so we will be converting to a exe application file so now to convert this it is very simple we have written this console application which contains these th these three lines which is hello world message this is another hello world and a read line so now to publish this it is very easy just go to your project folder click right click on this and right click and there is a publish option here so right here this is the option here you, that you need to select here publish option so if you select this option here you will see this window here appearing to you and then what you need to do is that 
you can just select Azure is kind of a cloud application if you want to deploy it to SOF then you will select this so in our case I need to only deploy it on our local file system so I will select the folder here and then what you need to do is that you need to select click once this is this will publish your application and it will create a exe file in one go which is called as click once so I will select this and then you need to select the publish location wherever you need to deploy your application you will deploy it so you will select the publish location so simply you will browse a certain location so by default it will select the project location inside bin and publish so here you will select your publish location simply select it and after this you need to simply click next and then again you need to click next here so basically it is asking for how will users install this application so you can just see from CD DVD or USB drive click next and then again click next these are just published settings you can also give it a uh, version number as well revision number all that stuff automatically check for updates from the following location you can also provide a location from which the app will get the updates so this is very advanced stuff so click on next and again click on next and then you can also configure the advanced option you can select any version number and click on finish to now and now it is saying that the app is ready to publish so now you simply need to publish this app so you will simply click publish button which is there inside Visual Studio 2022 condition simply click publish and now in the background it will publish this app here so now you will see published succeeded on 4th of March 2022 at this time so now we can open this publish location simply click this so this is our setup file is ready here you will see this is our launcher application so I need to run the setup file so if I click the setup exe so you will see this is uh, application install so it is very familiar window whenever you install any sort of window application you have this setup file you need to click install so you can just say publisher cannot be verified so if the publisher is not verified then this warning will come are you want to install this application I will say install it then it will install this application and then you can see this is the console message that we have written inside our application which is you can see in our code here if I just show you which is hello world and this is another hello world you will see that now you can see that and this is a third line which is waiting for any sort of response from the user so if I press any sort of key the application if I press enter the application will close so once again if I want to open the application I will simply now open this by using this application simply open this like this press the enter key to close it so this is a very simple console application which is I have deployed it into a separate exe file so that you can open this application without having to open the visual studio code text editor so you can send this all these files to your friend so that they can also use this console application so they don't have to install visual studio 2022 software they just need to have these files so just send these files to the friend and they will also run this application so let's suppose you want to change something and let's suppose i need to write something here console dot write line so once again if I make any sort of modification here so right line hello this is a third cons message so basically if I put this now if I open this two people are watching the stream guys so we are deploying this uh, C sharp console and GUI kind of application to set up exe file so now if I want to make this slight modification what I will do is that 
I will have to publish it once again so right click it and click on publish so here you need to delete the previous one so click on delete delete publish profile click yes and again add a publish profile like this again click the same instructions that I have shown you previously click the folder select it click next 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 and click finish so now it will uh, deployed it once more so it is ready to publish click on publish and now this app will be deployed and you can see publish succeeded if I hit the publish here so first of all you need to you can see this is our app here hello this is the third message so if I press enter like this so setup file is you can see that this is you can see hello this is a third message so in this way guys you can deploy this uh, console application now we will look at the windows form application this is quite similar so if you want to deploy a windows form application this is also very similar click new and uh, we will deploy it to a project new project I will say and this time I will select windows form and here we will say any name you can take click on next create this project so now this windows form project is creating here so the process will be similar so you need to simply I will have some widgets here some, something like this button I will have a simple button so whenever you click this button you will change the background color to red some functionality you can just write here and also it will say inside message box hello world that's it so this is a simple application that we have done if I run this application we will say if I click this button hello world will be printed out so this is the simple application so if I need to deploy this application what I will do is that simply right click it click on publish and again we will target the folder here like this provide the location simply next 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 and next you can see that click finish here so now it is ready to publish click on the publish button and it will now publish your application so now it is successfully published so this is our you can see that you can run this this is our launcher application here setup file you can also run the setup file as well so it will run this install like this so one more thing guys so you can see that all these application files which we it which is there right now if you want to hide all these files and just want to wrap it in inside a sim uh, single file what you need to do is that go to your project directory and there is a command out there you need to go to the video description link so there, there is a command out there here so just execute this command and what it will do is that it will hide all these files which is DLL files so let me open command line here in the project directory and paste this command so now it will hide all the files here and basically inside you can see inside bin release and dot net it will be deployed in inside the bin folder then you need to go to release dot net 6 windows windows x64 and inside the publish folder you will see your file here something like this so only you can see only a little files are there this is your exe file all the files are, have been compressed so that is why you can see the size of this exe file is 137 megabytes if you click this this is your application so in this way guys you can 
just convert your windows c, c sharp application to exe file and deploy it to the world so that other people can use your application so now you simply need to cut this folder and if you want to share this application with others simply you need to copy this and here you can send out to anywhere so if i want to publish here i can also use this folder here also so if i paste this publish so if i you can see that now it is still working so in this way you can publish your dotnet console and gui kind of applications in this tutorial i have shown you the step by step way by which you can do this all the instructions are given in the video description so thanks very much for watching this stream